I love our working people. past security and all the other airport shenanigans. Yeah, it's a little lower energy today. It didn't really seem that much, so a little less. But that's fine, that's fine, we move. We, obviously, every time you go through security, it's a bit of aggro, you don't know about the queues and everything else. But yeah, we've got it done. Waiting to board our flight now to Phuket. Love is in the air, everywhere I look around. A little later. Pulled up in Phuket, we checked into all the hotels. It should be a good trip in all, especially for training and focusing, getting your head down. Stay tuned and uh, we'll see what we get up to. Okay, so just about getting a good workout in. Boxing session, gonna do about 20, 25 rounds, proper, proper session. Yeah, we're gonna put you for your paces as well, J-Hubs. Are you ready? Yeah. Always, love that. Yeah, it should be a good session. Let's get to it. I love outworking people. In first, outlast. Mindset. Outlasting people. Being tough. Seeing it through. The mind game, man. It's a mind game. The following day. Okay, okay. Just got off the phone. The fly doctor himself, Dr. Daniel Alaya. Really, really good call. Spoke about a lot of different topics. Escaping the matrix and you know, living your life by your own design. We've been you know, really close friends for a good you know, five plus years now. It's very important to have the right people in your life. We're aligned in our goals for content, for financial betterment, for just growth as men, you know. We want to live life on our own terms, live the life we want, not someone else told us to live. It's about pushing to the maximum. You know, you can't just rest on your laurels. I think it's very easy to fall into a simple pattern of life whereby you just go to your job or you do the same things over and over. You don't ask yourself the critical questions of what if or how could I, or you know, looking at what resources you have, time, effort, money, people, infrastructure, really, really important. So yeah, fantastic call and all. It's got me G'd up. I'm gonna take over now on a conquer the day. Live life by your own design, stay focused. Don't get too caught up in what you're currently doing. Stay critical, ask the right questions, be the best version of yourself. We're actually going to a fantastic villa shortly. Stay tuned. Okay, so we just pulled up to this fantastic villa. Looks cool, nice little secluded road. Hopefully it lives up to expectations. Well, let's see what's what. Ooh, this is nice, this. Watch how that opens. Anyway, there's another one. Oh, wow. Wait, look at this. Literally, step into the hall. You don't step, you jump at that point. Cannonball! <laughs> They've got a bench in the shower. Oh, that is what I'm talking about. You there, chilling. Listening to Boss Edge videos. God. That's number two. J oh, woo! But you've got a rig. <laughs> it's got rays and everything. You're going to be editing for days. Little, little, little dressing gown. All the gear. It's going to be the J Hart's whoop station. I.e., you could whoop me. You're talking to me? Right, who, who knows? Man, man. You feel the heat up here, though, can't you? No, I was just about to say, half, well, halfway up those stairs, you can start we, to feel it. We thrive it. in the heat. We thrive in the heat. It's quite a nice thing, isn't it? It's like, oh, this is comfy. One thing though, I think we're short of a few pillows. Maybe it's just me, but I, I think we need a few more pillows, you know? It's just short of a few cushions. 
Okay, so final sit rep. I'm very, very happy with this place. The bedrooms are nice and spacious. We've got Jay Hubs' editing station. Yeah, should be a really good, productive few days here, actually. Vibe, isn't it? Night villa vibes and crickets. As we hunt for food. Look at that. Do you see that flash? In a tropical storm, we're the only animals who dare brave such storm in pursuit of food. <laughs> Anyone who knows me knows that when I order, I order. We don't mess about. We've got more or less everything on the menu. Maybe it's overcompensating, put it what you will. But having had the luxury of humble beginnings, when I order, I order whatever I want. If we don't eat it straight away, not a problem. We don't pull any punches. If it's a choice between two things, we get two things. If it's a choice between three things, we get three things. Time to tuck in. Let's go! 